Hello everyone, welcome to High School Mathematics channel. Today we are going to learn Class 6, Chapter 5, Fractions and Decimals, Exercise 5.3, Fourth Sum on Words. See now question number 4. The product of two numbers is 25 5 by 6. If one of the number is 6 2 by 3, find the other. See the solution now. Given product of two numbers equals to 25 5 by 6. Let us convert this mixed fraction to improper. 6 25 is 150 plus 5 that is 155 by 6. Also given one of the number is 6 2 by 3. Let us convert this mixed fraction also to improper fraction. 3 6 is 18 plus 2 that is 20. So 20 by 3. Let the other number be x. Now we know product of two numbers equals to first number into second number. Product of two numbers is 155 by 6 that equals to first number is 20 by 3 and second number that is the other number we doesn't know. So we have written here x. Now we have to find the x value that is the unknown value. So x equal to 155 by 6 here into 20 by 3 equal to after divided 20 by 3 that equals to 155 by 6 divisible symbol change it as into and write the reciprocal of 20 by 3 that is 3 by 20 3 table 3 ones are 3 3 twos are 6 see now 5 table 5 fours are 20 5 thirty ones are 155 now Multiply numerator 31 into 1, 31 by denominator 2, 4 is 8. Therefore, the other number that is x value is 31 by 8. See now question number 5. By what number should 9, 3 by 4 be multiplied to get 5, 2 by 3? Let us see the solution. Now we have to find a number. That when multiplied by 9, 3 by 4, we should get the answer 5, 2 by 3. So, let the number be x. According to the sum, 9, 3 by 4, after multiplying by a number, we should get the answer 5, 2 by 3. That's why 9, 3 by 4 into x equal to 5, 2 by 3. Now, we have to find the x value. So, x equals to 5, 2 by 3. Here, multiplied equal to after, it will become divided. So, write on division symbol here and write on 9, 3 by 4. Now, let us convert mixed fractions to improper fractions. 3, 5 is 15. 15 plus 2, 17 by 3. Division symbol, 4, 9 is 36 plus 3, 39 by 4. That equals to 17 by 3. Convert division symbol as into and write the reciprocal of 39 by 4. That is 4 by 39. Now multiply the numerators. 17 4s are 68 by 3 39s are 117. Therefore the answer is 68 by 117. See sixty sum. A bucket contains 34 and half liters of water. How many times do you get one and a half liters of water? Let us see the solution now. Quantity of water present in a bucket that equals to 34 and half liters. Number of times one and a half liters of water is required to fill the bucket. So that equals to 34 and half divided by one and a half. So let us convert these mixed fractions to improper. 2 34s are 68 plus 1 that is 69 by 2 write division symbol 2 ones are 2 2 plus 1 3 so the answer is here 3 by 2 now 69 by 2 convert division symbol as into and write reciprocal of 3 by 2 that is 2 by 3 2 table 2 1 time 3 table 3 ones are 3 3 23s are 69 so multiply 23 into 1, 23. Therefore, 23 times 1 and a half liters of water is required to fill the bucket. 
See now seventh question. The cost of three three fourth kgs of sugar is one twenty one one by two rupees. Find its cost per one kg. See the solution. Cost of three three fourth kgs of sugar equals to one twenty one and half rupees. See now cost of one kgs of sugar. We have to find the price. So that equals to one twenty one one by two divided by three three by four. Let us convert mixed fractions to improper. Two into one twenty one that is two forty two plus one that is two hundred and forty three by two divided by four three is twelve. Twelve plus three fifteen. So write down fifteen by four. That equals to two forty three by two into write down the reciprocal for fifteen by four that is four by fifteen. Two table two ones are two, two twos are four. Three table three fives are fifteen. Three eighty ones are two hundred and forty-three. Let us multiply the numerators now. Eighty one into two by denominators one into five. That equals to eighty one two sir, one hundred and sixty-two by five. Let us simplify this by doing division with five. Five threes are fifteen. Sixteen minus fifteen is one. Write the next digit two, five twos are ten, twelve minus ten is two. So write hundred rupees thirty two two by five. Therefore, cost of one kg of sugar is thirty two two by five rupees. See now question number eight. The length of a rectangular field is twelve one by four meters and its area is sixty five one by three meters square. Find its breadth. Let us see the solution now. Given length of a rectangular field equals to twelve one by four meters. Also given area equals to sixty five one by three meters square. Let breadth of a rectangular field equals to x meters. Therefore, area of a rectangular field equals to length into breadth. Now let us substitute those values now. Length equals to twelve one by four into Breadth is x. Area of a rectangular field is sixty-five one by three. Here, multiply twelve one by four equal to after it will becomes divided by. So write down x equals to sixty-five one by three divided by twelve one by four. Let us convert these mixed fractions to improper. Three into sixty-five is one ninety-five plus one. That is one ninety-six by three. Divided four twelve is forty eight plus one forty nine by four. That equals to one ninety six by three into reciprocal of forty nine by four. That is four by forty nine. Seven table seven seven is forty nine. Here again seven table seven two is fourteen. Carry five. Now the number is fifty six. Seven eight is fifty six. Again seven table seven one is seven. Seven fours are twenty-eight. Now the answer is four into four sixteen by three. Let us simplify this by doing the division. Three fives are fifteen. Sixteen minus fifteen is one. So the answer is five one by three meters. Therefore, breadth of the rectangular field is five one by three meters. Today we have seen chapter five fractions and decimals exercise five point three four to eight sums. Hope you all like this video. If you like this video, please like, share to your friends, and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.